sound production treatment, or SPT, is the other treatment that I want to talk about. We've studied this treatment since uh, the early 1990s with our first report coming out in 1996. We're still studying this treatment. And I, uh, this is just a brief overview of this treatment. So it uh, goes from minimal clinician cueing to more and more clinician cueing as needed. And it's what's called a response contingent hierarchy. So you use the steps only as you need them, only as the patient makes an uh, incorrect response. So it starts out with the clinician providing a model and asking for a repetition of the target word or target phrase or target sentence. Right now I'm going to use my example as being a target word. So the clinician says, say this word after me, son. If it's correct, the clinician elicits five more repetitions. That's great. Say that five more times, son, 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 son. So ask for five more repetitions and then moves to the next item. If it's incorrect, then the clinician says that's not quite it. Let's try this other word. This is a word that you said or, or similar to what you said. Let's try ton and a minimal contrast word is added in. Um, if there's, there are steps then to elicit production of that minimal contrast word, and then after that's elicited, then we go to step two. At step two, you, the clinician shows a printed letter or a printed word representing the target sound. Uh, so in this case, it could be a printed S. The clinician says, let's focus on this sound. This is the sound we're thinking about. Let's try again, say sun and request some uh, repetition. If it's correct, five more productions are elicited and you go to the next item. If it's not correct, then you go to step three, which is integral stimulation. That wasn't quite it. Watch me, listen to me, say it with me. Correct production, five more productions are elicited, you go to the next item. If it's incorrect, you go to step four and you give articulatory placement cues and integral stimulation as needed that's specific to the sound error. So that wasn't quite it. What you need to do is put your tongue behind your front teeth and make a little bit of a hissing sound. Let's try it again. Still not correct at that step, then you go to the next item. 